Adeline learns about friendship, written and illustrated by Adeline K. Choi. Published by Kids Edge. One night, Adeline was in bed dreaming. In her dream, she was rich and had five puppies. She wore the nicest clothes and the most expensive jewelry. She had loads of friends, and they all loved her. Adeline woke up the next morning, feeling a little bit weird. As she looked around her room, she noticed that something was not right. She looked down at her hands in shock and screamed loudly. She had become completely animated. Adeline looked outside her window and saw a rainbow, ponies, bright and colorful houses. She walked outside and bumped into Princess Twilight Sparkle. She had light purple skin and a dark purple mane with pink streaks. Her eyes were lilac, and she had a pink star next to her tail. She took Adeline to her castle. Her castle was made out of lilac crystals. First, she brought Adeline to the throne room. It had six chairs. Next, she brought Adeline to her library. There, they met Starlight Glimmer and Spike. Finally, she took Adeline to the living room to rest. The next morning, she was in the throne room with Twilight. Suddenly, she bumped into Applejack, who she called AJ. Twilight was shocked because Adeline knew her. Adeline told her, "I've met AJ before." Then AJ and Adeline started making jokes. Twilight told them to stop joking around. While Adeline was with AJ and Twilight in the library, she bumped into Rarity. She said, "Oh, I'm sorry. I'm in such a hurry. Wait, I know you. You're Adeline." Then Adeline said, "Yes." So Rarity took out a beautiful dress and said, "Try this on. You'll look fabulous." Then she helped Adeline to try on the dress and took her outside to explore. Rarity brought her to the big city called Manhattan. There were many ponies there, and Rarity bought Adeline three more gorgeous dresses, then brought her back to the castle. Then Adeline met a whole group of ponies, and they kept saying "Ed." They came close to Adeline to give her snails, worms, and slugs. Adeline quickly flew off to tell Twilight that they were scaring her. Adeline did not know that she could fly and use her unicorn magic. Adeline landed outside the castle. On her way to meet Twilight, she bumped into the Pie family, who were arguing with Twilight. Marble Pie said, "Pinky and her friends are supposed to be the princesses, not you." Then Adeline came and heard the fighting. Adeline suddenly had an idea. Adeline said. What if Twilight was not a princess for a day? I'll ask my new friend Starlight Glimmer to turn Twilight into a normal unicorn, but just for one day, so she can have a chance to be a princess too. That's a great idea," said Twilight. So they asked Starlight Glimmer to turn Twilight into a unicorn to stop the fight. After that, Twilight said thank you to Adeline for stopping the fighting. So Adeline said, "You're welcome." A few minutes later, Adeline went back to the portal and fell asleep in her bed. When Adeline's mum woke her up, Adeline said, "Princess Celestia." Well, Adeline thought she was back in Equestria, in that world with Twilight and her old friends. Then Adeline's mum said, "Did the dream teach you a lesson?" Then Adeline said, "Yes." I learned the importance of friendship.